we are standing in what is called the Sahat Abdel Menam Riyadh or Abdel Menam Riyadh Square. It's one of the busier squares here in the heart of Cairo, just adjacent to uh, Medan al Tahrir, the Liberation Square. It houses from where we are just a few short uh, kilometers away the Ministry of Foreign Affairs, the Ministry of Information, Egypt's National Museum, some of Egypt's biggest hotel chains. So this is a very, very significant part of the city. And that bridge that we keep talking about, the October 6 bridge, one of the most important thoroughways that cuts all across Cairo from east to west. You can see traffic on it is moving very, very slowly. The vast majority of the people right now are underneath it and what seems to have happened over the past few hours and actually what you're seeing right there I'm gonna have our cameraman go down you can see people breaking into uh, the barricades of one of the hotels now that hotel where you're seeing people run across uh, is the Hilton Hotel there are a lot of tourists that have been uh, looking out their window watching what's happening now what you're seeing the protesters are being dispersed using tear gas they've managed to break through the barricade of the hotel and are trying to find and are trying to find refuge at least somewhere there you can see more tear gas being fired at the protesters uh, and more of them are coming our way you right there Ayman yeah yeah sorry come on just where more uh, more tear gas canisters are being fired direction no, of our building actually towards the protesters and you can see and and you can see it unfortunately because the tear gas is is kind of uh, we're just gonna take your just time one second stay with us come on yeah, take your time Ayman Ahmed 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 Baddil there, what you're seeing right now are, are pictures, Kamal, of the, um, of the tear gas. We're just going to switch out just one second our cameraman so that he can actually try to bring you these uh, unprecedented pictures. But as you can imagine, the tear gas is making it very difficult sure. for us to see. So there are the images that you're, you're seeing right now. You can imagine what it's like for the protesters. I mean, we're several dozen, floor, we're several dozen feet above uh, the street level from our studio. You could see these uh, pictures. Uh, and now that area has kind of been dispersed as a result of the tear gas. You can see some of the people at the hotel trying to run and uh, you just gonna have the camera show you what the view is like. This is the Hilton Hotel in Cairo. Many of the tourists that were standing on the balconies watching this unfold have gone inside as a result of the tear gas. And on the streets, some of the protesters that were really gathered around us, this scene, what you're seeing, is where they were just praying. Uh, several hundred protesters were praying just a short while ago. Now it's completely uh, been dispersed. They have gone under the bridge. I don't know if you can make it out as a result of the silhouette there, but most of them have now gathered underneath yeah, that bridge where on top of it the traffic has really come to a standstill. You can see some of the vehicles actually trying to, they've stopped, they're trying to pull back. It doesn't seem like they want to go uh, much further. So it is a, a very critical showdown that's taking place here right around this very critical intersection for the city.